Welcome to the Loadright L3180 Operator Training Video. This video will cover basic operation of the Loadright L3180 loader scales to optimize loading with accurate payload measurement. Topics included are warm up lifts, zeroing the scale, activating auto add, weighing material, clearing the total, subtracting a bucket weight. The Loadright scale will turn on automatically when you start the loader. If the scale has been shut down for more than two hours, the screen will prompt you to perform three warm-up lifts. This helps to bring the hydraulic fluid up to working temperature and allows the scale to verify all scale components are working correctly. Lift the boom slowly and steadily until the warm-up lift count changes. Repeat for warm-up lift number two. Complete the final warm-up lift. Now you have completed three warm-up lifts. The scale will prompt you to check zero. Before you start any shift, and occasionally during the day, you'll need to zero the scale. This is necessary to periodically zero the weighing system because small errors can occur due to buildup of material in the bucket. To zero the scale, roll the empty bucket back to the stops and lift slowly and steadily through the weighing zone until the weight of the empty bucket is displayed. It may not read exactly zero due to material buildup or machine temperature changes. Press the zero button. Your scale has now been zeroed. Your load right scale can also be set up to automatically add a bucket load when lifted past the weighing zone. This means you won't need to press add after lifting each load. To enable auto add, hold down the add button. Auto add function is now enabled. To weigh a bucket of material, Simply drive into the stockpile and fill the bucket as you would normally. Roll the bucket all the way back against the stops. Lift the bucket up steadily through the weighing zone. The weight of the material will appear on screen. If you have enabled auto add, payload weight will be automatically added to the truck total. Subsequent bucket weights will be added to the truck total. Once the truck has been completed, Press the clear button to reset the total before the next truck. If you added a bucket accidentally, you can remove the bucket weight by pressing undo. The unwanted bucket load has now been removed. 